Hi everyone and welcome back to my channel. So as you can tell by the title today I am here with a vlog style video for you. Um, I thought what I would do is since I actually have like a free week this week I would do a week in the life type of vlog like f come with me for a week whatever um, and basically just show you guys what I go up to this week. Um, I'm literally just about to go out, um, so I've just done my hair and makeup. Um, excuse this, my makeup literally always goes on the inside of my jacket. But I had originally filmed like the start of the video and I did show you guys me actually getting ready. But then literally I just thought, do you know what, I'm not putting that in there. So I'm already ready now with my foundation on my jacket, which I need to sort out. This is my outfit. So I've literally just got on. Let me see if I can push you back. So I literally just have on this Zara top and then we've got some leather trousers and a North Face jacket on. Super cute. Um, I've just got to go and do some shopping. Can you guys even see? Yeah, I'm literally just going to go out. I'm waiting for a wig to come as well, which is really annoying because I ordered this wig yesterday and it's supposed to come today. Um, and it was supposed to come between 12.15 and 2.15. And literally, they always changed the time. So now it's gone to 12.30 to 2.30. But I can imagine it's not even going to be then. So I'm literally sat here ready already. I don't even have my parcel. I'm not even planning on going out until I've got my parcel. Um, and it's like half 12 already at the minute. But... Yeah, this is just my outfit and outfit vibes. Super cute with the leather trousers there. Um, and I'm loving the makeup. This is just my everyday makeup, guys. Um, super simple. And then I've just got my hair in this easy slip back bun. So that when my wig comes, I can just shove it on because I'm literally so excited for this wig. Okay, guys. So the wig has literally just come. Oh my God. So this is just a lace closure wig, looks like this. And this is the hair, super cute. It's like a body wave, virgin hair, super cute. 24 inches as well. Um, so I was gonna wear this out, like I was actually planning on wearing it out, but now I actually just can't be asked to get ready. Do you know one of them? When you've already been ready, and now you just can't be asked because you've already been waiting. Like, I actually can't be asked now to wear the wig. It even came with some free lashes. But I'm just thinking about how I'm actually going to style this. Obviously, we don't want it to look super wiggy. But... It is quite a decent length, to be honest. Okay, guys, so I'm literally about to... Oh, my God, what is going on? So I'm literally about to go out now. My room is a tip because I've been getting ready. Um, But yeah, like I said, the wig did come. Um, I'm going to bleach the knots. I am going to go ahead and bleach the knots, and I'm going to do all of that. So I'm going to do a separate video on that so i'm gonna go ahead and buy all of the products now this is my outfit i've just got on my specs dior specs no face jacket gucci bag leather trousers and we got the and we got the balance Argus. but yeah this is the outfit outfit of the day so yeah, I'm about to go out now. I am honestly blind as guys. So I'm literally wearing glasses. If you didn't know, I am literally so, so blind. Like I literally cannot see anything. So yeah, I'm gonna go do some shopping, whatever. I'll check in later. Thank you. Currently in next. I'm steaming up here. This is the outfit. That's so cute. And I like these cushions.
these ones are really good in the room. Yeah, these ones. They go. So I'm literally just in TK Maxx right now. Look at the homeware. These look so cool. Oh, they've got them in blue. Mm -hmm. You're starting to smell the smell. Didn't you have these sprays before, these ones? Yes, I just bought one up now for the bathroom. Cute. So, I'm trying to find the bleach for my hair. Um, I thought they would have like separate packets for like the powder. So, literally just in Tesco right now. Shopping, I have so much food in here, guys. So this is the shopping so far. Been super drug, TK Maxx, and now I'm just in Tesco doing a bit of a food shop. Um, but as you can see, I am back on the healthy eating. Got yogurt, salmon, vegetables, you know. Gonna make some healthy soup tonight. Honestly, if you wear glasses during a pandemic actually you cannot see anything because all that happens is my eyes just steam up 24 7. i'm actually so done in like literally leaving the house is just not for me anymore like honestly i'd rather stay inside because i cannot stand shopping centers i'm literally just coming from the shops but yeah what i was saying guys is i literally feel like it's so easy to go off track when you're on a diet if you don't have like healthy snacky type foods in the house if not you're just going to be going through the cupboards you're going to be eating chocolate crisps and things like that and that's fine fair enough but you need to eat it in moderation if that's the only thing you have you're not going to be eating in moderation obviously if you've got like healthier snacks in um it does just make it easier to snack on and also if you avoid buying like loads of sweets and things like that then it's just not going to be accessible to you i think that's the main thing is the accessibility when the sweets and the chocolates and everything is just so easily accessible you do just snack on it because it's just there um but if you don't have it in the house then obviously you're less likely to actually snack on it so i'm not saying that i don't eat chocolate or sweets at all because believe me i literally eat it the most um but um, i did pick up the bonville buttons so these look like this. So rather than, again, like snacking on like milk chocolate, um, I have just gone and got the, uh, the dark chocolate. It's all about moderation alternatives. Rather than getting the milk chocolate packet, get the dark chocolate packet and you could just have like a little bit or you could put a couple with the yogurt, like making yourself like a nice dessert but it's almost healthy um so yeah those are just pretty much the things that i like to eat and snack on i just thought i'd show you a little haul but yeah guys that is pretty much it it is literally like half five now um like we literally just got in like 10 minutes ago i'm just gonna go ahead now um i need to put the pillowcases because these two pillows at the back like i was washing all my bed sheets and those two pillows are supposed to be pink so i need to put those back on um and then, yeah, I think I'm going to start the bleaching process on this new wig. Um, I'm not even going to be cooking until super later on tonight because um, I'm cooking someone else as well. Um, and I'm also going to make an apple crumble. So I'm going to be really productive today, very productive. Um, but yeah, I'm just going to go chill for a bit and I'll check in with you guys later. I thought I would just go ahead and do like a quick haul um, and show you guys what I got today. Um, so I went into TK Maxx really quick and I found these trousers. They're just like a PVC um, snake skin style trouser. Um, so I'm not too sure how these are going to look like on. Um, but, you know, we could definitely style these, definitely make these work. These were £13, guys. So I was like, let me pick these up. Um, I've never heard of them before. It's called, like, Liquor in Poker. I don't even know, guys. Um, but I thought these were super cute. And then on the back, it's just got, like, the little brand logo. Um, but, yeah, these are super cute. Um, and I can't wait to wear these. Oh, yeah, liquorandpoker.com. Never heard of this before. If you've heard of it, let me know um but yeah these are the black croc 
vinyl skin trousers that's what it says so yeah i picked up those and then i also picked up some cycle shorts they had some these are so soft as well like i can't even tell you guys how soft these are um but these are just some like nudie colored camel shorts uh cycle shorts i don't have any in this color and i feel like this is such a needed color so i picked these up these were literally 3.99 um so they're just some super cute little basic nude cycle shorts um, I also picked up, I'm so random, like I am the most randomest person, um, and then they had this rollerball perfume gel, which looks like this, and I thought this was so cute, and this is neroli and lime leaves, and it was £2.49, but I literally just thought like this would be so handy to just put in your bag, mm, that smells so good, that smells literally amazing like actually amazing there was two of these i should have got the other one that smell is so nice guys 249 these are just perfect to put in your handbag like just throw these with you and then whenever you need like a little touch up you've got your little roller ball so yeah that's so so nice um and yeah health it's got by heathcote and ivory that's the brand and the last thing that i picked up from tk maxx Oh no, it was not the last thing actually. The next thing I picked up was some coat hangers. Um, I always need coat hangers, I'm running out. So I just picked up some of these. Uh, you get 25 in a pack and it was 7 dollars um, Yeah, 7 dollars and you get 25. So these are perfect. I literally have no space for any of my clothes. I am in the, like, in the process of trying to do a dressing room in my house, but honestly, it's taken so much time right now hi everyone and welcome back to my channel i say welcome back like this isn't a week long vlog i just feel like am i even going to be able to keep up with it for a week um i have on the wig um but as you can see like it's not really fully finished yet um because of the hairline also it is tuesday and i did just get my eyelashes done this morning um they just look like this so yeah i just got eyelash extensions um because it's just so much more convenient for me like i just prefer to have like all of my treatments sort of already done rather than wearing like strip lashes i do prefer the individual lashes so i got those done um but i just thought i'd come on here and say hello this morning as it's like almost two o'clock and i haven't actually vlogged yet <laughs> okay guys so i actually already uploaded the um I can't even speak. I can't even speak. I actually uploaded the wig install video already. Like, I don't know about you, but like, once I get excited about something, like, I just want to put it out there. And like, I had the vlog going on. I had the hair video going on. I was like, do you know what? I want one of these videos out. Like, when I film a video, I just want to put it out. So I've uploaded that one now. So watch this and then go ahead and watch the wig video if you haven't already. Um, I'm literally just straight up chilling but honestly I actually need help because I've got a really good laptop for just everything like obviously I can edit on it whatever um but it is so annoying every time I'm trying to because I do record my videos on my iPhone every time I try and upload the videos from my iPhone onto the laptop and I do just use like a cable to do it the files just will not upload there's like an error every single time with the file and it doesn't upload so then i'm having to edit my videos on my phone and upload them from my phone which is so annoying because i can't add the background music that i want to add like it's on my laptop i can't get it on my phone like it's just really really annoying so if anybody actually knows how to take like videos from an iphone onto a mac without that error because i have googled this and it looks like so many people have the same problem i just don't know what it is i need help hi everyone so i just thought i would do a little bit of a check-in it's literally 3 15 and i'm just sat in bed i'm doing absolutely nothing this is literally what happens like i book a week off work all the plans go to shit so i'm just stuck with a week off work basically so i'm literally just enjoying my life whilst i'm off work because honestly i just can't um but i'm just watching renee's vlog um miss our fabulous um literally love her videos um so i'm just watching her weekly vlogmas 
um and that's what i'm doing but that is pretty much it guys um I'm, i've just built a zoo to be fair not gonna lie so i'm probably gonna smoke this and then chill um i'm gonna make a snack later on probably like some salmon or something um but other than that that is literally it i am just chilling corona has just made everything dead okay so it's about 4 30 now so look how dark it is like it's so dark and it's only been like an hour um but i'm literally still in bed i'm gonna go eat something i haven't eaten anything today um so i'm gonna make something now to eat um but yeah let's go make some food this is the first thing i've eaten today um, so it's just rye vita crackers with smoked salmon, um, light cream cheese, and then obviously cucumber as well. Um, but this is just a really nice light and healthy snack. And obviously it doesn't bloat you out or anything. So I like things that are just, um, you know, quite light, but it is still really filling because you do get four of these in each pack. Um, and then after I just have a banana. But... If you guys want a video on like my healthy eating tips and things like that, then I definitely will do that. Um, I do try and eat healthy as much as I can and obviously like work out as much as possible. Um, and I do like to watch what I eat. So yeah, I'll definitely do a video sort of maybe what I eat in a day and also like how I lost weight video as well, um, as well as how to maintain it. basically this is what it is so i've got banana and then for the grains i just use this um it's the dosset cereals i literally this is so nice and it's actually got dates inside of it and golden sultanas as well um and it just looks like this um and then obviously i put the pomegranate in there as well and i had this yogurt here um, now optional you can also add honey to it so I am going to add a little bit of honey just because this is going to be my dessert so this is like a healthy kind of dessert um, to have so rather than obviously like snacking on like chocolates and sweets and stuff this will literally just crave like fill your sweet tooth basically um, sometimes as well you can also add peanut butter um, I had this one. It's the Whole Earth Crunchy Dark Roasted one. I've not tried this one before, um, but this will be really nice either on like rye beaters or, you know, you can even add it to this if you want, but I'm fine with just the yogurt. So yeah, I'm going to eat the rice and then I've got that as like my dessert. Add a little bit of honey but i'm just doing it really thin um again obviously if you add too much it does just defeat the whole point of this supposed to like supposedly being healthy-ish so yeah just do everything in moderation um with it basically morning guys so today it is wednesday and i am literally back again at vlogging what time is it now it is Okay, so it's literally 10 past 10 in the morning and I actually set an alarm for 8 o'clock but I didn't even go to bed last night until after 1 so that didn't work. Um, but I've literally been up now for about half an hour and I'm tidying my room. So as you can see from my bed, I've clothes everywhere and I've got the hangers which I bought the other day and I'm going to go ahead and hang up a lot of clothes but i'm also going to be giving away a lot of clothes to charity as well um i've got a pile over there of clothes um which i'm going to give away like some things are new whatever um warm clothes as well because it is winter but honestly i just get into the habit of buying so many clothes and then once i've worn them i'm just like was there any point in even buying that um i'm not gonna wear it again i don't even have space for it type of thing so 2021 is not going to be doing that i'm going to be just buying like actual things that i need so uh, yeah i'm going to get rid of like half of my wardrobe today okay guys so i'm going to do a quick workout this is what i pretty much do all the time it's just a quick 10 minute workout 
So that's what I'm about to do. Just for a snack, so I'm not like eating anything unhealthy. I've just got some cucumber and some green pepper um, because I literally had the tiniest amount of cucumber. So I made some green peppers as well. And then I've got the Tesco Moroccan style hummus. Um, I don't think I've tried this one before, um, but it does actually go out today. So I do need to use this. Um, but these are just good snacks. Um, obviously, if you portion it out correctly, um, because it does have 5.6 grams of fat per quarter of the pot. So you don't want to have like loads of this. Um, but this is just a really great snack. Um, and obviously, if you are exercising as well, this is like one of my main things I always say. Like I never restrict myself to eating anything because if you do eat everything in moderation and then you are sort of like working out as well, it's just oh, you can eat something unhealthy but you work out you're gonna burn it off type of thing um so yeah um i'm just gonna have this as a snack hey everyone so it is now seven o'clock and a parcel has literally just come um from asos can't even tell you how long i've actually been waiting for this i don't even understand i've got um asos next day delivery um free for a year and i ordered this stuff around the time of black friday and i think for some reason on asos like they don't automatically select the next day delivery even if you've already paid for it for a year so i've been waiting for this parcel for literally like three weeks now um it was due to come on the 17th of december but it actually came a day early um but yeah i'm so excited because in this parcel there's some new makeup which is annoying because i've just done my makeup now um but yeah Okay, so inside I just have this first thing here and this is an Adidas tracksuit that I ordered. Um, so I'll try that on for you guys in just a moment. Um, and then the next thing that I got was some masks. So this one is, these are all like feet masks. So this one is the heel patches and I got two of those and that is with salicylic acid and tea tree oil. So I got two packs of those. And then I also got the Baby Silky Foot Mask Sheet. Guys, take care of your feet, please. Like regular pedicures and obviously in between. Um, this one's by Holica, Holica, which I have actually tried masks from this brand before. Um, I really like these Asian masks. Um, and then here I got the NYX Sweet Cheeks Blush. Um, so this is in the shade... Mm, I actually have no idea. Oh, this is in the shade bang bang okay so this is how this blush looks like but it is not really the shade that i thought it was going to be from the picture um excuse my nail i literally only got these done last week and it's already chipped um but yeah this isn't the shade that i thought it was going to be so i am going to give this as a christmas present um but it's a really nice color um but it's just not sort of the blush shade for me okay, i also got a bronzer from nars um i really needed a bronzer and like I said, like, I was waiting so long for this parcel. It was supposed to come. And um, because it decided to take like three weeks to come, I had to order another one in the meantime. Um, so I've just been using a sleek one. But this is the one that I've been waiting for. So it is, I'm hoping it's the right one. It's supposed to be, oh my God. And I've literally just cracked it. Um, but this is the one, guys. <laughs> um, so yeah, this is the bronzer really really nice can't wait to try this right so it's 10 to 9 now and i'm just about to 
skirt out. The Adidas tracksuit on. It looks so nice on. It's the corduroy tracksuit. And it looks like this. I have cycle shorts on right now. Um, but yeah, it just looks like this. It's got the sort of ruched bit around here. So it like clinches in at the waist. Um, I love a tracksuit where it's still like fitted. Um, even with velour tracksuits, like with the top, they are always like fitted. So they still look nice. And I feel like you can dress them up or dress them down. Do your hair, make up nice, you can dress it up, or if you just want to chill in the house. Um, but to be honest, this material on this one, with it being more like corduroy, it is more like a going out tracksuit. I wouldn't actually really lounge about in this one, um, just because it's just quite a thick, hard material, so it's not like super comfy to chill in, um, but it is really nice. So I'm just wearing this. Um, I'm just going to go out, probably get some takeaway or something. Um, but yeah, I've been eating healthy, so I'm probably going to have a takeaway now. Um, but yeah, I'm going to check in when I get some food. Oh Alright, so it's now Thursday and it is like 11am. But I've just done a workout. Um, it was a decent workout, not gonna lie. So I'm just gonna put a couple of clips in. Um, but I'm definitely gonna do this one again in the future. I will link the workouts in the description bar down below as well. show you the wig that just came um this one is just a synthetic wig just because i do feel like i do need a little bit more practice with like styling it and everything um so i do just have a synthetic one this time but this time it's a lace frontal um so i have more like room to like work with um and i'm gonna go ahead and sort of do all the plucking on this one here and see what we can turn this into um I'm going to do, like, when I actually apply it, I'm going to do the bald cap method as well. Um, I don't think I can bleach the knots on this one because it is just a synthetic wig. Um, and there's also not too much space to really actually, you know, bleach the lace because the hair only goes up to sort of this section here. Um, but we'll definitely see what we can do. Oh, my God, this wig. <laughs> Hi everyone, um, so I'm literally, so I am just at home chilling and it is, what is it, it is 10.20 right now, I'm just at home chilling, um, I did get some good news, um, I got a text message earlier on in the week, I think it was like yesterday or the day before, I'm doing a week long vlog and I actually forgot to even mention this, um but a driving instructor did actually message me if you guys watched my 2021 goals video you would have seen that i was trying to do a crash course um and that was supposed to happen around this time but like i said i, I knew it was gonna happen um it didn't go through and that is just because of the whole like covid basically um all the driving tests are just being pushed back um so who knows um, when I'll actually be able to do the test itself um, but all I actually want to do is just the lessons at this point because I haven't done any lessons like I've never needed to drive it's just something that I just want to do now um, so I need to get my lessons in there um, I was going to do like an intensive course like a crash course for it but again things haven't gone to plan so it's not all going to be in like one week like I thought it was going to be um, but I am going to be doing two hours on Saturday and two hours on Sunday um, so I'm looking forward to that it's going to be my first lesson like I don't even I don't even know how to feel um, but I'll let you know how it goes once I've done it um, so that's what I've got to do for the rest of the week other than that I've literally just had the most boring week like I don't even know if it was worth vlogging or not um, but why not why not try something new um, who knows literally I'm just chilling Honestly, COVID, there's nothing to do. Um, it's just nice to have a week off. Like, I don't even feel bad when I relax like this because I actually work so hard, like, so hard, period. Like, all the time, day in, day 
day out like i am grinding for that bag and so sometimes it is just nice to just have like a week where you can just relax and really just like just literally relax you've got no responsibilities just purely relaxing and just doing things that you want to do is just like the best time and um, because I'm such a non-stop type of person like for me I I'm just non-stop all the time back to back like I have to be doing something and whether I'm working or whether I'm self-improving or just doing something like I just need to be busy like normally I can't just be sat doing nothing. Um, but I do feel quite productive this week because I know that I am still doing this YouTube vlog and this vlog is like a week long. Um, like in the back of my mind, I'm just wanting to like edit it, but then I'm like, it's okay. Like it's a week long. Um, so I know I've got that to come, but it's just like the fact that it's not finished yet is just like, it's like I've started something, I need to finish it. So I'm like, can we just get to the weekend now? Um, because I actually want to commit to this vlog. Like, I'm committed to doing it every single day. Um, but that is pretty much what I'm doing. I've already eaten. I forgot to vlog it. Like, I am shit at vlogging. But where I live right now, we literally can't go out for food. And it's really shit. So, there's nothing to do. Um, but, yeah, guys. That is it. I'm not sure if I'm going to... I'm so tired that's another thing i get so tired like i'm actually so tired and i haven't even done anything like is that even possible but yeah my eyelashes are cute or whatever the wig turned out good as well i'm not gonna lie kind of hi everyone so it's five o'clock now and i'm just chilling at home as usual i did this wig it looks quite cute um but i did just want to come on um because i was just watching renee's story um miss our fabulous um and i was just watching her instagram story and literally i just thought it was so relatable like everything on there like when you're securing the bag when you're doing things for yourself, you're doing self-improvements, you're actually taking the time out to be like a better person and like do better things and just just all around be a better person. Like when you're trying to do things for yourself and other people and you've got it all together, you've got a man and things like that, you know, people can see that and that is when they really just be hating on it so much and people want you to act out of character like when you have it all together like when you literally have everything like you're doing well and people just hate to see it like they really hate to see it honestly and mm -mm. once you've already sort of distanced yourself from people like that and you've taken yourself back from it obviously it's easier to not get caught up in that but people are just generally just hating on you for no reason it's easy to get caught up in it but if you are working on yourself and you're doing things for you and you are just wanting to be a better person then it's easy to see what people are trying to do and people try to bring you down onto their level but I think it's so important to just remember to stay grounded, to stay focused and just remember to stay in character. But yeah, I just I saw that story and I honestly just thought it was it was definitely something that was relatable to me. I'm just it was a very relatable situation. And I just wanted to say, guys, like, you know, sometimes people do push you to different levels and people may say things and start things and people can try but as long as you just remember what your goal is then if you're focused on that one thing then you will not you will never let any of that ever get to you ever like I think that is the thing that has got me through like a lot of just bullshit situations in general like I'm so concentrated on one thing and I think anything else that just gets in the way of that for me is just it's got to go basically it just has to go like I'm not getting involved Gemma Collins whatever that is like I am not getting involved like I'm sorry I'm just not I'm sticking to what I'm doing and I'm focusing on that I don't know about you I don't know what you're doing 
but I know that I am focusing on securing the bag and being a better woman, being a better person, um, you know, following God. Never forget, like, never forget to continue doing you. Never forget to continue being the best you that you can be. I feel like we all need a reminder at some point in time, like, we can so easily be taken back to, like, a different place um if someone's triggering you do you know what i mean like someone's pushing your buttons like you're gonna react but i basically just feel like all in all just don't even rise to it like literally if people if people really want that much of a reaction from you like it says something about them really so i don't get involved with it not going to lie but no seriously like i literally just thought like I just wanted to, I just wanted to put some real talk into this vlog, like, honestly. And when I saw that, I just had to speak on it. I just felt it's so relatable, this situation. And it's sad that so many girls out there just don't want to empower each other. And they do want to bring each other down. Like, in this day and age, we should be trying to uplift each other as women and supporting each other as women. And it's so easy for people to come on social media and say things like that and then not actually do the same thing back. Um, but I just feel like you need to practice what you preach and, you know, every day just be working on you. Like, literally, always just focus on you and set yourself a goal and just aim towards it and don't fall out of that lane until you've basically secured everything that you wanted. But that is basically all I have to say today. My red lipstick is smudged. This is why I just keep this makeup on in the house. Um, but yeah, guys, this is going to be the end of the vlog. This is like the longest video I've ever done. I don't know if anybody's watched the whole thing to the end. Um, but if you made it this far, definitely subscribe to my channel and give it a thumbs up. Um, don't forget to leave me a comment down below if you like this video, if you want to see any more types of videos like this. Um, I enjoyed filming this vlog. Um, shame I didn't make it seven days, but seven days, this vlog would have been like an hour long and I haven't even done anything and it's half an hour. So, <laughs> yeah guys, um, thanks for watching and I'll see you all in my next video. Bye.